Shit, what's this podcast called? Discourse of Human Events. The, the discourse is just crazy, crazy, crazy. Everything's okay, I'm just trying to wag my age. Yeah, I wanna know. Basically, about to do the whole bank thing, right, and leave these peeps behind. Yeah. yeah. So now you have all the bodies. Uh, whatever you, I don't know what you're doing. Like, there's Does anybody bank. remember the exact plan we had with those? We're going to kidnap the manager. Uh huh. Oh, that's before, right. Get in there early before anybody comes. He's going to be blindfolded. Mm-hmm. Um, we'll be doing all this. Do on on this manager. What's that? Did anyone do any recon on this, this uh, manager? No, you don't know no. who this person is. Right now is. we just set up the bodies. Maybe we got the bodies a bit early. Maybe we were a bit hasty on that. <laughs> you gotta do Maybe this before they start acquiring a smell. I don't know. Yeah. Our that plans to burn them beyond all recognition. That. <laughs> just just make, put them in the fridge a little bit. <laughs> what fridge? <laughs> yeah, what fridge? Well, Josh, there are some ice spells that can cast. <laughs> That's what you want to do. Keep it fresh. Do you, Josh? Actually, uh, Josh, we're going to need ice. Let's actually do do that. Like a big slab of ice like they did back in the day. A big. How many bodies do we have? Like, So you now have two humans, five? an orc and a kobold. That's four, an elf, five, and an dwarf and a gnome, seven. You have seven dead bodies in your room. I'm, I mean, Christ. I'm going to summon a fucking glacier right now. <laughs> What's that? I have to summon a fucking glacier. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what uh, This was your plan. Maybe we need to dedicate a room as a body room. Like, put a bunch of ice in the room. And throw them hey, guys. In there. Yeah. Uh, I, yeah. I think well, maybe we should destroy their face so that uh, you know they can be. Oh, it's gonna be burned. We're gonna burn. We're gonna, yeah, gonna, gonna be burned. Burn, yeah. right? We're right. burning the whole place. I forgot. Mm. We're gonna make sure they get pretty doused in accelerant <laughs> before we set the fire. Oh, uh, uh, rather than cover hard. up the smell, yeah. we could acquire some fish. Wait, put it away, though. Instead of Josh casting a ice spell, just cast a spell on them that gets rid of smells. Oh, okay. Yeah, good uh, point, the, sir. Smell destroying spell. Is that what you want to do? Aura on these bodies so they don't freak if it, this ends up taking longer than needed. Still but how long does it take? But smell like a rose. Smelling. Yeah, it's not, it's they don't smell right now, but okay. yeah, yeah, like a couple is days. It, is it summer or is it winter? Um, I'll say it's autumn. Autumn? I think I'm good, guys. Mm, <laughs> yeah, it's not going to go like a day. I'll say you guys got like a couple days before people start noticing something. But if we do this recon and then we get like arrested or something, what are we going to do then? Huh? We're gonna have people stay back with the bodies. Yeah, we have that. Yeah, uh, Helden and everybody. Helden's the always guy we always forget about. Yeah, he yeah, we have a whole team of NPCs. <laughs> Is, are these people so trustworthy of us? We must have a really big room. No, you guys had two rooms, remember? So I think That's right. you. Uh, yeah, we forget split what the split was. I think uh, Zach, Chloe, the gnome, and. That's right. The door were in one room, mm-hmm. then the rest were in the other, something like that. All right. You can be that's like right. next to each other. That's fine. Okay. All right. So we'll have them hold up while we do some recon on this manager and kidnap them. Okay. 
Do we really need to do much recon, though? Like, can we just follow him home and kidnap him? Pretty much. I mean, oh, what right. recon are you going to do? Follow who home? The bank manager, right? Like, manager. What's the last person that comes out? The manager. Uh, sure. Usually they close the place down. Okay, so they, who's doing this? Uh, okay, so somebody has to go in, see the manager, and we have to follow them. So somebody has to actually be the one to go in the bank and follow this person. Who's the least suspicious of us? It has to be one of the humans. Uh, I can just... Who has the best talking? Me so? Put, put on... Cut your hair in the best... I want to speak to your manager haircut. <laughs> and... Charge in there. <laughs> don't really need to speak to, to the manager. You just need to see him. He demands to see the manager right now. Yeah. I'm I'm just gonna give some ridiculous request to the cashier and the the cashier says he or she couldn't do it and I say, I demand to see your manager. Okay. Mm-hmm. Why are we That's getting the manager? I don't understand. So you know who the manager is. Yeah, so you know who to follow. We right? did not deduce that just from looking. No, why would you know? I mean do you wanna just go to the bank at first and just see what's going on yeah, there? Yeah, let's that. Let's do that. Let's all just scope it out. Written a bit of a description, or at least something. No, I don't want to see do it. that. <laughs> that right. sounds like plans and shit. We don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> Are you We're getting like, all together? Luck. <laughs> I, I'll say, on what less otherwise stated, it's only you four. Okay. 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 And maybe Yip Yip will walk along okay. without his great game. Yip, Yip always follows behind. Ten paces. But that comes in okay, the there we go. <laughs> he time. doesn't come into buildings. No. no. Yep, yep, does. Okay, there we he's go. Yep, yep, your lookout. Exactly. Okay. And, and he so says, guys... yep. His name is Yip, sir. His. Yep. His dog is Yip, yep. So you're okay. Not being there. I'm being what? Specious. His name is <laughs> Yip. You're being a okay. All right, a little bit. All right, so you guys go to the bank. It's three floors. Uh-huh. You have no idea what's on the second two floors. It's a huge but bank. Yes, it's a big bank. Uh-huh. It's it's the main branch. It's like the headquarter bank. Okay. Okay. This is why they would have documents there. The lawyer lets you know this is where they would store them. So the first floor is a bunch of tellers. There's five tellers, and there's three small offices on the left side. And on the right side, there's the stairs leading up, up. So that's what you know. All right. So who's going to get this manager? Uh, it's a busy place. There's people, plenty of people hanging out, doing whatever. So we're just kind of chilling in the lobby right now, looking around. Yeah. You, there's a little lobby with a few chairs if you want to hang out. Okay. So what would require a manager to show up aside from regular banking business? All right, Chloe. Try and buy something with uh, your spices. Wait, don't we have... I want to speak to your manager. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh by the way, I'm sorry. There are guards. I, I forgot that. There are two orc guards uh, both posted at the door. Okay, so... I give them I a think... head nod when I walk in. Like, orc to orc? Yeah, uh, two orc to orc in. Love. I think usually, like, when you need a loan, they would uh, have to speak to a manager, right? So, I'm going to come Loan officers. Yeah, they yeah. have loan... Yeah, exactly. You need to when, speak okay. to the manager. Try and buy something yeah. with spice. And get really offended. No, like by it. if they if they deny my loan request, then mm-hmm. I'll demand to see the manager. Oh, that sounds like a plan. Yeah. What if they maybe you need a loan to pay off your lawsuit? Yeah, yeah there you go. <laughs> what if they just approve it though? It's like, yeah, sure. We... Yeah, because because she's an orphan girl. <laughs> Nothing with your <laughs> name. No money to her name. <laughs> His hosting has been sketchy. I doubt they would just give me the money. Okay. Anyway. Is, is that what you're doing? Yes. Okay. So, uh, you go in and you uh, request to get a loan. Uh-huh. And, yeah, a loan officer comes out. They go and get one some guy from upstairs. Uh-huh. He comes down. Uh-huh. And he meets with you in an office. Uh-huh. And you describe to you, what what are you asking a loan for? Okay. So, um... See, I have a um, pretty successful uh, manufacturing operation to produce torture seasonings. But uh-huh. recently, I've been sued by my uh, business rivalry 
<laughs> for <laughs> for what the paper I was served on? Uh, you agreed to give him the recipe, but then you gave him a fraudulent one. Okay, I was sued for fraudulent, but I never agreed to give him the recipe. It was it was a forged signature. Okay, the loan officer. I'm not sure what this has to do with the bank. But you see, <laughs> uh, I, <laughs> I need a bit of money to cover the lawyer fee that I'm paying to uh, defend myself. Ah, I see. Okay. Yes. And where are your manufacturing operations? Uh, do you have the deeds to the... Uh, is there a factory? <laughs> what is there? No, what assets do you own, miss? But I, you got to understand, sir, this is a family business. We do it We do it at home. you we got to keep it closed. And uh, how much revenue do you have? Well, last time I checked, how, how much did I make with the, with my supply like, though, sir, in the clock clock? Nothing. You traded it for mining supplies. Yeah, how much does the mining supply worth? I don't, I don't know, like a what grand? About 10, gold. <laughs> <laughs> Ten thousand gold. Ten thousand dollars. You can say dollars. They're basically dollars. Yeah, <laughs> He's like, and can you prove any of this? We need like a registration of your business. We need documents, lady. <laughs> But sir, it's a family manager. We never had such a thing. We have been doing business for years. I demand to see your manager. I'm offended. He's like, I think maybe you should just go and talk to a business manager, somebody that <laughs> you know is more conversant in handling these matters. It doesn't quite seem like you know what you're doing. What's your language, sir? I feel deeply offended. How do you dare to treat someone like that? Is that your attitude towards the customers? Uh, I don't know. It depends on how much money you have. Oh. Um, so, okay. Roll your... I'll roll your talking for you. Um, Thank you. Uh, okay, that's one, between one and a four. Yeah. Forty-one. He says, "Ma'am, don't make me ask for security." Chloe, yeah, we would have had if you if you did a, the proper haircut beforehand. Exactly, it's all about the haircut. Is <laughs> <laughs> it that hard to get a manager? Like, I don't even know why you would need to roll. Like, if anybody asks for a manager, you usually get yeah. a manager. <laughs> oh no, <you> yeah. Don't. <laughs> yeah <what? laughs> really? So you weren't being, no. yeah, you were being a little crazy. I don't know. Now if you're being enough to where, like, uh, I'd rather just get security. <laughs> just trying uh, to buy a loan without any business. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. Is there a water fountain or something? Uh, a water fountain? Get it? What are you no. doing? Why would there be a water fountain? A water cooler or something? No, this isn't like the 20th century. <laughs> 1800s. What? They have, yeah. Uh, they have no beverage for like the customers. I don't. Was there normally in the eighteen like eighties? No. Let's say. Let's say <laughs> I don't know. Was, I wasn't around then. I don't, when I see movies and they have banks, they do not have a water cooler, Josh. I don't. I have no idea what his plan on is, but it involves a water right. cooler. Okay. okay. Alan, you you got to get a loan now. <laughs> I don't, I, I don't think it's that hard to get a manager. Well, if you just try something hard, else, uh, you've only said that you have to get security. You can try something, some other tactic. Oh. <laughs> uh, just say, I'd like to talk to a bank manager, please. <laughs> Saying please often does help. Okay. Fine. Get me crazy. Um. That's the recipe is the only thing that's left by my parents, and I'm okay. an orphan. Oh, Jesus, you rolled a one. Dude! He's not very sympathetic <laughs> to you today. <laughs> He's like, uh, I don't know. But he, you do see him softening a bit, but he thinks you kind of smell or something. <laughs> I, I don't know, you rolled a one. i got to get something for that. <laughs> a one? Wow. Yeah, I feel like this is, this has failed. Uh, ma'am, maybe you should to try one of our editors. I think maybe they'd be more accommodating. Oh. Um. 
Oh. <laughs> <Come> on, you <laughs> all. Uh, they they deal with smaller businesses better, I think. He's just gonna okay. like that. Uh, uh, what should I do? Where am I at this? You, you're out in the lobby. Yeah, with everyone else. Do they have pens in the lobby? Yeah, they have, not in the lobby. They have them. Yeah, I'll say they have pens in the I lobby. Got, I, I, I just to. go up to the. Drop a pen. I'm slip and fall on it, and you start <laughs> screaming. <laughs> Lawsuit. No, 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 no. I got a better idea. <laughs> I, I'm just going up to a cashier. Okay. I really want to make a very large deposit. I'd like to speak to a bank manager to see what kind of security <laughs> yeah. this uh, bank offers. Too much money for them to handle. Compared to Absolutely. What? That's, that's not easy. <laughs> that's a good idea. <laughs> you sit down and say, you're going to give a bunch of money, they'll be like, yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, she asks, how much uh, are we talking about? Uh, I have a, a five million. Uh, give me one moment. And then she, you see her come out of behind the back of the teller and she goes upstairs. And she comes out with an elderly uh, elven gentleman who comes up and asks you to join him upstairs. Okay. Uh, I'll take Josh with me. He's my business associate. Okay. Because I'm sure he'll screw this up somehow. (laughs) All right. (laughs) Yeah. I know how to gay stuff now. (laughs) So. I mean, really, we just need to find out who he is. Yeah, all we needed was his face. Oh, yeah, no, now we can slip out the upper level. What's yeah. That? Oh, that's true. Yeah, so you go like, up to the third like level. It, when he gets off work and stuff. Sneaky ways. <laughs> okay. So he walks you up to the very third floor. Um, yeah. It seems that it's divided into two halves. Um, there's two doors on one side, one door on the other. He walks right, you. Is there anything on the second floor? Or. Um, yeah, if you're looking specifically... Yeah, I'm pacing it the entire time okay. I'm walking up there. Yeah, as you pass by, you see several just uh, office workers, basically, and they have, I don't know, like the equivalent of a cubicle, like just small desks. I guess that would be the thing back then. They just have yeah, lots of several little that. desks, uh-huh. several file cabinets all over the place, uh-huh. and they're just doing some sort of work. You know, I mean, you're not bankers. They're doing something. Uh, yeah, but right. he takes you up to his uh, office. It's the one big office. Uh, and it says President right on it. Um, what's his name? I have a name. His name is... His name was Robert Paulson. What do you know? Shit, where did I put that? Uh, Wistar. His name is Wistar Zilda. It's an elf name generator name, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. Huh. Yeah, I did. Just to keep track of everybody. There's a lot of people in this thing. Okay. So he, like, you know, he sits behind his desk, mm-hmm. asks you guys to sit in the couple of chairs across from him, and asks mm-hmm. about the nature of your business, and, uh... You know, what What brought you to this town, that kind of thing. Zach, if you want a drink. Sure, I'll take a drink. Um, yeah. You know, we like to keep our business operations private right now. We're just trying to see what kind of uh, promotions you guys have, what kind, of, what kind of services you guys offer versus the other guys. Why should we put our money with you guys versus another bank? What kind of interest rates do you get back on things? What? Jesus Christ. Uh, <laughs> he describes, you know, he just gives a bunch of details about his bank. And, uh, it's the biggest bank in the city. Uh, they have a lot of income from the miners. Uh, they give you standard interest rates. Top notch security, you can tell by the guards they had downstairs. Uh, you know, he just gives you a big, big, like, uh, what were you? Okay. No specific ROI and everything. We want to. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of, what kind of... Put his money, your money, in these uh, minings. A lot of them, you know, they're yeah. rock solid investments. I don't know. So what kind of per- drink? What kind of personal service? Each you brandy. Well, what okay. do I do? What, 
Uh, you got Randy, thrown out. Down you? You're, 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 down. You're, you're being escorted out right now. No, no. <laughs> what do you want to do? So, uh, Zach is still out. Yeah, Zach's in the lobby. That guy is just basically trying to convince you to get out. Okay, so I, I walk out to the lobby and mm-hmm. grab Zach and mm-hmm. ask him, like, hey, do you want to wait for the outside when they come out? Because okay. yeah. Zach has uh, seen that guy's face, right? No, Zach hasn't. It's uh, Alan and Josh upstairs. With yeah, but the oh, yeah, he's seen the face. Yeah, yeah, yeah he's seen the saw face. Him. He came downstairs yeah. to get okay, him. Okay, so um, I ask Zach to um, shall we wait in the back door, or okay. like somewhere the Just bank is in our vicinity? Outside. Yeah, I mean, we could have waited outside. in the lobby, but they don't like you, so now we have to wait yes. outside. <laughs> 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 Whatever. <laughs> We're gonna chill with uh, Yip outside while they're doing. This. Okay. Mm-hmm. Watching I'm, and how uh, many people come in and out of the building. I'm asking what kind what kind of personal attention are you willing to give our account? Like your best customers. Like I've talked to other banks and you know the manager is always on standby if I have a problem. He lives close to the bank, so if I have a problem, he can come down right away. Uh, are you willing to offer that type of stuff? You guys roll your talking. That's good stuff right there. Uh. 71. Ooh, okay. You have a shitty role. Even though you're not... You don't look like a rich person, but you seem to be confident. So he believes you. Yeah, uh, what were you asking? Uh, what kind of personal service does he give his best customers? Like, I, I, can is, I, he I, yeah, is he on standby? Like, does oh, yeah. Like, he says... Clothes. Okay. If I have a we problem... Have, of course, every biggest... Uh, large accounts like yours. Uh, I live only a few blocks away from the bank. I'm available at all times. You can come to me personally if you have any questions with an account of that size. Um, and yeah, he, all services, you know, for that kind of an account. Okay, that sounds really good. That's the brand he's <laughs> The top okay, notch. Thanks. Bye. <laughs> um, he wasn't sure because I don't know how well Alan's dressed, so he gave you mid shelf, but past oh, it, it was top shelf. I'm gonna see. If, I'm gonna roll my knowing if I know this is not. <laughs> and remember, this is not all. Okay, go go for it, Josh. I'll give you a good plus to knowledge for you. Roll the ninety nine. Okay, you know it's mid shell. You know he's passing it off like it's in the nice oh. little container, and he poured it for you and handed it to you like it was the best stuff. But you know, you know it's like you know the brand, and you know it's not top shelf. <laughs> I, I uh... <laughs> what do you do? You, <laughs> you now know this. I mean, while I'm drinking it, I do. It's in the exact brand that he served us. I'm like, is this, um, is this what you serve to your person there? Uh huh. There. What? That's <laughs> right. I think he's drinking. drunk already. I do yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. Like, <laughs> is you too many? What's that? As I'm drinking, I do mutter the brand that the brandy it is. I just shake my head a little bit and set it on the table. Oh, like Ooh. uh. <laughs> He apologizes, and then he uh, goes below, and he says he wasn't quite certain about you, and pulls out the top shelf from below and pours it and hands you that. Okay. Good stuff. <laughs> now, now, now that you have shown your refined taste. That was important to establish. Was that, was that acceptable? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if he wasn't sure we about our team people. now, he knows it. Okay. Yeah. I, I just asked for a business card and thank you for your time. Yeah. We'll... And he says, please come back. Uh, we can get the paper started. He's just definitely trying to sell you as, as you and walk how, out. How, how long are you are you here till tonight? Like, what time do you? He you says working? he'll be here until. Uh, he says the bank closes at five, but he usually doesn't leave till six or seven. Okay. All right. Thank you, sir. Thank what time you for your you time. open in the morning, just in case we've. Sleep it, on it. it. It opens at 9 a.m. And, uh, you know, he keeps trying to sell you on it. <laughs> also, uh, what specific path do you take home? <laughs> yeah. Do you draw me a little map? <laughs> uh, 
All right, so we we're, we leave. We're going downstairs now. I think we've got enough in there. Uh, All right. So it looks like we can just wait six or seven until that guy came out. And see what kind of info they found out. Okay, yeah, you guys can meet outside. Yeah. Now everyone knows everything. So what is what are you guys doing now? So I know it's like one o'clock right now. So I know what time he leaves. Now we just gotta mm-hmm. trail him home. So who's mm-hmm. gonna follow him? Who's our best sneaker? You can have all of you guys just like as a group. <laughs> My sneaking is three. Like it's gotta be. Oh, yeah. It's gotta be Chloe because he's oh, right, just he knows yeah. the fashion right now. And you're an org. So it's kind of obvious. I'm not very sneaky at all. <laughs> yeah, it's got to be Chloe. Yeah, you're sneaky. Yeah, wait, we also have Yip. Don't forget Yip. Come two. Follow. Oh. No, Yip's basically borderline retarded. <laughs> what? He walks oh, around on, on a great day. He kind of sticks out a bit. A dog could follow somebody. Yeah, I guess. I don't... Do you want Yip to do it? No. no. You can just follow him. I mean, the kobolds stick out to it. This place, this is the, no, this is below ground, so it's mostly doors, some humans, a few of the other types. So, uh, I'm going to, actually, I'm going to follow him, mm-hmm. and I'm going to prepare my chloroform. Okay. <laughs> Are you going to do this immediately? No. <laughs> well, just in oh, case, I'll right keep I'm it ready. <laughs> okay. So, uh... How are you following him? Well, I, uh... Well, he's leaving at 6 or 7, right? Yeah. So, oh, assuming wait, at that time it's already uh, dark. I'll tell you, right, right. it's not too dark. It's... Uh, hey, he lives within a couple blocks, right? Yeah, yeah, let's yeah. look around the block. Yeah. The best way to follow somebody is to do it in team, you know, like... You follow them down one street, and then somebody's waiting at the intersection and follows them from there on. That way, they don't yeah, know they're being yeah, followed. The problem is you need some way to communicate that, and you yeah, guys, yeah, how would you do that? And and also, the uh, um, not the bank are already seen Alan and uh, like, yeah. Josh. Yeah, but he has to go the right path. Sorry, what were you saying, Kelly? I said the bank are already seeing Alan and Josh. Yes. Yeah, so they recognize them. He's like, why are you following me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but like that, no, you don't know your. You're just happening to be walking around the same wait. street. Wait, okay. wait, 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 wait. When he comes out, can't you wait to like happenstance one of you two, preferably probably Alan, accidentally bump into him and be like, oh my gosh, hey, we accidentally like slept too late, but I wanted. To talk to you, I can like just follow you home and talk to you about. No, because then he might just invite us back no, to the bank. Yeah, he'd invite no, no, you wouldn't do invite it. us to his house. Now, if we bump into him near his house, he might go into his house. That's what I'm saying. You want to try and do it a little closer to the house than the bank. But we don't know where his house is. But we can follow him for half the distance. And then what? Sprint. <laughs> Good point. Good point. I think we're um, we're just fine with Chloe. Like finding what house he goes into yeah. and we just freak in. Yeah. So I'll tell you this: this bank is surrounded by a bunch of mining company offices, offices, restaurants. So it's just a, like a typical downtown district. Okay. Maybe there's an insurance company. It's always an well, insurance company. Well, can we so, walk the couple blocks and find where there actually there are is houses? There's a street, right? Oh, there's so find the closest to residential place. You either go a couple up blocks. one way or down the other, right? Yes. Yeah. So if Yip follows him down this street, at the end of the street is one uh, is Chloe at one end and uh, Zach at the other, Yep, they can then follow them from there. That way, somebody's not following him the whole time. Okay. So Yip will basically be our tip off of where yeah. to who who begins to follow him. Right. Oh, what's your sneaking? Mine. Yeah. Uh, five. Five. You don't really need to. I mean, it'd be weird if you're sneaking behind them. You yeah. just have me walking in the same direction as them. Some of you could um, walk the imp as like you're walking the dog. 
to can carry some distance. You're walking, yep. Uh-huh. Hey, guys. He doesn't have any dog. Wait, walking, yep. is there a problem if he does let you back into the bank? We can just kidnap him at the bank. That's yeah, true. Yeah. The guards would have left. I think. Yeah, everyone else would leave. What? What's the problem with that? That's not actually a bad mm-hmm. idea. We could all already be in the bank then. How, how do you let him know that you need to meet him off hour? Does he have the way of the... No, you run into him, or you could be rushing to get to him, bump into him okay. like I was trying to get to you before so you close. He Either has, he's going to take he has, you to the house or, or back into the bank. He has business card, right? What's mm-hmm. the yeah. way of contact that's written in a business card? Oh, right, yeah, just, just a bank address. address. Yeah, it's just a bank address at this point. There's no such thing as right. telephone. No telephone? All right, fine. I say we just bump into him and he either takes us to his house or takes one of you guys to back into the bank, which the way is good. He am conscious. Huh? I, can, can Chloe brew a quick knockout that doesn't last very long? Uh-huh. What? You're chlorophyll. That I can put in his drink. Oh, yeah. Because we need him conscious for the actual bank heist, so he thinks it's us. Why it got to be a drink? Why is just a Because... Rabbit? I can ask for another brandy. Now he knows I know his bullshit. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> okay, I like that. I can slip in his drink. It's just the oh, other people. Josh could be the one to bump into him, and then he can open the doors for us. Why not just both of us? I mean, we're there. Yeah. There might be some good guards I need some heavy lifting with. That's true. All right. Okay. I like this place. So that's okay. the point. So you guys are bumping into him, you two. After hours, so about, you said they close at 5, you say mm-hmm. until 6. We'll wait till about 6. And you're like, as he's walking, you'll, what are you doing to, till you see him walk out? Like, what are you, you're just standing there at the thing, and no, like, no, as yo, soon as you, you open uh, the door, smashing into him, and be like, hi. No, no, you, pre- you, uh, no. just, just, uh, or probably you're like, you're, eating at the restaurant and you had a couple of drinks and you walk outside you just saw him and he said hi. Yeah. You know? I mean, we could like, we could be like a building or two down that we could see yeah. him and then proceed to walk as if we were just walking around town. Yip oh. Yip will be our clue off. So Yip Yip will be watching and as soon as he oh. steps and come out of the building, he'll, he'll uh, tell us. He'll, what so. signal is he giving? Hi. He's gonna signal by saying yip yip and riding off into the sunset. Huh? <laughs> okay, there we go. <laughs> good? No, he'll just he'll ride back to the the okay. hotel. Okay. In okay. the meantime, can Chloe and I get the bodies ready in a carriage? Because we can just our wagon. Place. Yeah. Wagon, yeah. 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 Wagon. Sure. Okay. So you, you know, need to bring ready. the wagon to the the bank. Well, yes. just yeah. Outside. Yeah, so we're that the, we can tell already. Uh, we're That's ready good. to deposit our whatever. Okay. It's in the deposit wagon. Our body. Is there any preparation you're doing for the bodies? They're just a bunch. Of, like, how are you getting from the hotel down to your carriage? Oh, um. Hmm. Good oh, question. that's a good question. How are we putting these bodies away into a carriage without anybody noticing the seven bodies that were here? You know what? <laughs> okay. Also, wait a the way that uh, Rock delivered them to you, he had the gnome and the dwarf body. He just had a big bag with uh, that looked like mining equipment, and he just stuck yeah, it I'll in there. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll carry them all out in bags. Oh, wait, 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 wait. mining up. equipment. Try and make it look like this carriage is filled with a bunch of money. Like, we can throw some of yeah. our money, right? Filled out. Yeah, yeah, you have yeah. yeah, I think you like have 25 bag. Yes. Build bag of money. So if we put the bodies in the wagon, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and then you know cover them up with I mean, tarp or something or whatever, yeah. but then stack them up right off. there, and then have the money stacked in front of them. Yeah, we can just exactly. open up the small flap, and he just sees the money. He thinks that the whole wagon's full of money when really it's okay. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. yeah. So well, pretend we that, that he's going to come down and take the money himself? Yeah, what? He's not going to do that. Then he'll definitely okay, so wait for the bank to open. We're there with yeah. this wagon, and we're like, sir, we think we want to go with you. And we raise up the flap, and he sees money. We've got to tell that. him 
So we can tell them we don't like sitting on this money here at right. the end. Here we have all this cash. We don't like sitting on it. <laughs> but then he's going to call people to help deposit it. Yeah, I'm not going to exactly. do it himself. <laughs> I, I think you guys just have to let us in and while we have that there. But we need the money in front in case we get stopped for any reason. Why are you going to get stopped? Wait, it just sounds like you're you have a wagon. It's a horse and a wagon. We have a wagon, right? We're yeah. carrying around seven dead bodies. I want to sure. hide it in case something. Covered up. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we also have horses. You guys are on the. We're on the horses, me and Alan. You guys are on the wagon in the back with all the stuff. Yeah. Okay. Okay. We ride up just as he's walking out. We can't find into the bank. You guys are already there. To unload. We don't need to talk about money or anything. We're just like, we want to discuss it further because we think we're going to go with him. Yeah, either invite him to the bank or back to his house. Either way, it's fine. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. So, yeah. we Josh, what's the plan when you inevitably fail to give him poison? We need our plan B. Uh, Alan What? <laughs> Alan just beats him up. Uh, I didn't hear what he said. Alan beats the shit out of him. Oh, okay. Well, uh, I would say while he was reaching for the, uh, like, top shelf. You don't have to worry. He's just an old elf. Yeah. It's yeah. Whoever else is in the bank, maybe a clean crew or when a guard stays over. No. That's what we need to worry about. How do you have a magic use? Saying, you, what's our plan B? Your plan it's B still is still two on one here. True. true. Uh, what did you roll as a talking Alan? Was yours ninety or something? It's when I did the talking, seventy one. Yeah, 71. my knowledge of alcohol was a ninety nine. Okay, yeah. I'll let uh, you know that he trying to brag said something about his wife being a magic user. Being a very well respected wizard that does very important magical research. But he didn't say anything about himself. Oh. Hmm. But that still doesn't rule it out. Well, we can't go with what ifs. So we're just going to roll with it. So, <laughs> All right. That's how we do. That's how we do. What if one is asking for the better <laughs> liquor, I can just sneak up You're on You're not in there. What? You're not in there. Why would he invite? He doesn't. We You're the crazy him. lady. No one knows who you are. <laughs> he doesn't know. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't. Uh, he sure he heard probably the story. heard the story by now. Let me say for this chick with the chicken spices. Yeah, but I would say they probably didn't give an exact description of you. Okay. All right. Let's just let's get this show on the road. Yeah, all right. Let's get it started. Okay. Yeah, we can. We can tell them we're ready to sign a deal. We want to we wanna sign something. So who's doing what? Well, that's what I need right now. Okay, so Alan and I are on the horn. Just, uh-huh. just a little bit down from the bank. When we see him coming out, we'll ride up the full way. Okay. They're and behind the bodies us. are in the back of the caravan in like yeah, some sort of cart. They're behind or, us with the yeah. carriage, the cart with the dead bodies and all the supplies and on it. Covered up. covered, hopefully? Or are they just dead yes, bodies? Yes, covered up. Covered. Everything's covered. Okay. And I'm it look like all front of, equipment. So if you lift up the back hatch, you'll see the boxes with the equipment, mm-hmm. and the bodies are behind the boxes. But they're just bodies behind boxes. No, they're, they're in tarp the bag. over top of everything. Mining bag. Okay. Okay. In mining right. bags. Okay. Right. And I'm gonna use a point when I talk to him to try to oh, make sure okay. this doesn't f up. I'm <laughs> 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 oh, good at that part. So you are bumping into him and saying what? That, you know, we thought about it all day. We're ready to find something. We just want to get it off our mind. Know that we're secure in your bank. I know it's after hours. We tried to get to you, but if we could go in and find okay, something so to make us now? feel. Yeah, yeah it's happening. This is fine. Time is Bump it? It's secure. 6.30. He, he leaves around 6.30. It's 6.30. Yeah. It's not nighttime yet. No, I mean, it's getting a little dark, but not fully nice. Are we underground? Oh, yeah, actually you are, so I guess it's all lit We're up. underground. 
Yeah, it's lit up with lanterns. It, it is the whole time. So it's darker than it would normally be. Uh, it's it's ground. It doesn't. Yeah, it's always lit up. Re- the it's same brightness at all times. All the time. Right? Oh, lanterns and That's stuff. True. I forgot about that. So yeah, it's nice. bright. So yeah, we'll figure that for I out mean, later. bright enough. It's not as bright as day outside. Right. Okay. How's the traffic on the street? Uh, it's gone down. I mean, it's late at night, so most of the, this is the business district, so most people are heading up, have already left. But, you know, we need, they can't see the springing bodies in. We had to have those in boxes or something. Yeah, the back? back set in the mining bags. Okay. The same thing that Rock brought you the two bodies okay. in. Okay. Okay, so we have mine, er, okay. Yeah, All right. Each, each of the bodies is in a mining bag, and then that's covered in tarp. Yeah. I don't know what you can't carry mining equipment in. I assume there's some standard bagging thing or something you can carry it in. I don't know. Yeah, it's just like a tarp bag. Yeah, okay. Right, okay, so Alan does his talking. Canvas bag, probably. Okay, yeah. so Alan's assuming it's talking, all right. Okay, yeah, uh, Alan, roll your uh, number. Uh, 58. Yeah. I did use a point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's that? You're, you know, he, he says, yeah, yeah, he's very excited. Uh, and then he invites you back up and says, well, let's get the paperwork started. Um, I hope you bought all the, uh, I guess you're wiring the money? I don't know what you're doing. Uh, uh, bring it tomorrow rat. morning. Like, to get <laughs> yeah. some Is that really what you're saying? Uh, yeah. <laughs> as soon as we get to his office as he's talking yeah. about this. What do you mean I, wiring the money? There's no wiring in Yeah, have telegraphs. I asked if there's any more than that. No, they, they, have have they, they have telegraphs, yes. But they it goes from city money. to city, not person to person. Okay. Well, Which means physical. you go to a Western Union, and then the, one of their branches will say, yes, they deposited it, or whatever. Oh, I see, yeah. There are okay, things to work with, like in large scale answers like that. So, Alan, roll your talking. I want to see if you're bullshitting him well enough. I got to do it again? <laughs> Wait, yeah, I thought you already. Okay, I'll, I'll say you BS him well enough up to his office where he's pouring you some more uh, okay. brandy. Top shelf this time. So he's turning around, going below in the cupboard below where he keeps better, his best Better use a point, Josh. <laughs> Can, better not screw this part up. Yeah, how are you getting his his alcohol spiked? Exactly. Uh, we need to make him turn around. He's What's behind turned him. Around he before turned around before he pours it. Yeah, but to get the brandy in the glasses. Yeah, he hasn't poured it himself. Right. Or uh, wait, or... wait. Does he uh, go back underneath and turns around? Does that, or does he leave it out? No, he, he's going underneath to retrieve. He goes. He gives the glasses to you. Okay, you have two glasses. Yes. He has a glass. Hey, does he have a glass? Okay. Yes, he has a glass. Four. Uh, does that leave a liquid? I would imagine that would. <laughs> no, does he pour well, the brandy? He, no, right now, so you all have glasses. It's, they're all empty. He turns around. There's a shelf behind him. He lowers down, and he starts to take out the brandy from there. Are you doing anything? No, I'm going to wait till he has the... pours it, right. and turns around and puts it back on the shelf. That's what I do when he turns his back and puts it back okay. on the shelf. Okay. Will he turn around and put it back on the shelf? Oh, he just puts the bottle. Now, wait. Yeah. What's on the thing behind him? Josh, that is a gamble. What, what, <laughs> what's on the shelf behind him? I can see his shelf then, right? Uh, he has one brandy, the brandy he poured you before, uh, already up. Okay, I'll well, say so it's on his desk or nearby. So, yeah, he'll probably put it away because, I mean, well, I have two bottles out. Right. This is the this more expensive the rear brandy. Yeah. Okay. And you'll, I'll let you have known that he did that before, so it's a habit, so you could have planned it. Okay. Okay. So he turns, so he turns around and puts it back. Uh, do you want to roll your sneaking? I thought that'd be moving then if I'm doing it fast. No, it's still sneaking. It'd be sneak. You're sneaking a move. Yeah, you're okay. totally trying to do this quiet. I'll be using that point. Hmm. And I got 53. Okay, yeah, you do it with a point. That's no problem. Guys, subtract my point. Oh, uh, Chloe made this little uh, concoction. Mm-hmm. 
Chloe, yeah. you gotta roll your uh, making. <laughs> oh, no, you just might kill I hope you don't mess it up, Chloe. Oh no, we forgot about this part. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want? I'll let you press it. Do you want to press it? Because yeah. I pressed it so badly. Oh, you have to. No, it's between ten. Oh. And there you go. There you go. Okay. Um. Since right. You really got a four and a sixty-seven. Uh, Did we I'll see say, anybody in the lobby on our way up? Oh yeah, I'm sorry. I was actually supposed to mention that. Uh, <laughs> the two guard, order guard. By the way. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hey, you try to keep track of all these details. So the two orc guards had left earlier at five o'clock when it opened, but one night watch guy. He's one of the. He's an ayatollah. He's the armadillo person. Mm. He's okay. the night watch. Uh, you see him just walking around. He just the bank manager said hello to him and then just said everything's all right. He's taking you guys up and then just took you up. So he's down in the very first floor. The night watchman. I told are sneaky little devils. No, they're slow as shit. They're armadillos, right? Are they yeah. slow or are they fast? I said and they're slow they but armored. I said they're slow. Yeah, there you go. I say they're fast. Mm-hmm. Uh, okay, so he's passed out. Um, he seems really passed out. Okay. Right. It seems like <laughs> Chloe made this a little more powerful than you expected. Oh, that's fine. Okay, so I'm talking to Josh. What? Do we just, like, you know, get the guard's attention, say, oh, he's passed by out, or he's, like, he fell over, he's choking something, get him to come up here, just ambush him? That would be the thing, say he had too much, let's give him a little while, say he had too much to drink, if he's going to be out for a while. Okay. So? So? I mean, we just need him to come up. We need him to come up in a hurry, though. So you guys are on the third floor. Right. Yeah. Okay. Did we notice anybody on the second floor? No, no one's on the second floor. Okay. Aren't you guys supposed to switch in the dark? I'm going to have another brandy. <laughs> <laughs> so what's the plan? What are you doing with his drink? What do you mean? What are we doing with it? Just you staying like in front or of anything? Him? No. Like, how fast acting was this? Uh, it was pretty quick. Like, uh, yeah, like 30 seconds in, he started to, uh, like, uh, then drop. Good stuff. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. A little too good. Mm-hmm. Now, is this, uh, I'm assuming Alan didn't bring his gun because he wouldn't let him to. A, a, I wouldn't I be able to. Uh, what is he, he searching me? Run into a bank? I mean, no, how could I not here. hide a gun? What is he searching me? I guess. I'd be sneaking. Maybe he has a gun around here. That search is always for a gun. I would say search on loot. I never said he was searching you for your gun. Yeah. I, should, I should have asked if you had a gun. <laughs> that would have been... I it's guess you can walk in with a mind. gun. Yeah. I mean... These were the kind of days I don't, when guns don't don't you. I don't, yeah. yeah, in the bank, nobody searched Yeah, in the 1800s, can you walk into a bank with a gun? gun? To a bank, I don't know. No matter what. They have any ordinance where you can't wear a gun inside the city. You can wear them in the city. They don't mind. But I would say a bank, you'll probably clear by the guard. You have a concealed carry. Yeah, but but so the day guards, Uh they would have requested you give them the gun. But now it's nighttime. Yeah. Alan used a point, and what is your role? Uh, When I did the talking? Yeah, to get into this place. You used a point and rolled something pretty good. Yeah. I'll say with a point. He, he, points are pretty good. He, he'll he let you... He won't even mention the gun that you had. But before he took them, the guards even let you in the bank. They'll take them. Okay. So he has his okay. gun. Yeah, he okay. can have his gun. Okay, I'm still he was very excited golf. about the money. I'm still searching his officer. Any cool shit I can pocket? Any what? Cool shit? Any cool shit I can pocket. Uh, yes, that. You're trying to rob the guy. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What the hell? <laughs> uh, yeah, he'll have nice pens and uh, I don't know <laughs> all that. about pens? <laughs> What's a business office? Yeah. Yeah. 
he has the brandy, which is good. Uh, I don't know if you have the capacity to carry that, but... Maybe looking for yeah, some I mean, documents. Yeah, he'll have a couple hundred dollars on him. What's that? Yeah, I have documents. a couple hundred dollars on me. <laughs> I don't know. Like, they... Bankers... Bank usually have some important documents, right? Yeah, um... His his documents are usually just very business related. He's the president. He doesn't have like every document ever. It's just uh, related to what he's working on at the time. Yes, that's what I'm looking at. Uh, maybe just uh, some documents that mention uh, the legal, like requisitioning the deposit slips and the withdrawal slips by those brothers. Those maybe catch your eye, but uh, you don't actually see those slips here. So, yeah, I mean, just something requesting from the legal offices of the city, requesting the deposit slips and withdrawal slips and whatever, all relating to Bitter Fury investment. Uh, he should have some keys, right? Uh, yeah, he'll have keys. He has keys. I would say probably took all his keys. Okay. Just in case you need to get into a place in the bank. Yeah. Well, we gotta take out the guard right now. Well, we're giving him a little bit of time so we can. Well, he's on the the first floor of the guard. You're on the third floor. We can say he got out, but we're gonna call up. Yeah. Like, hey, can we get some help up here to carry him down? You had a little too much drink, so break. So that's what you're doing, right? Wait, wait, wait. You're doing that? Why not? You have to have to ambush the guard. Yeah, we're him. gonna ambush him when he comes up to help us carry him right. down. Are we done searching his office? All right. Okay, we'll do uh, that. Then. That was you. That was your thing. <laughs> hey, I got some. I don't know what. Ten. Four hundred dollars. Fuck you. You ain't getting anything. <laughs> <laughs> a couple of times, spends a couple hundred dollars. <laughs> and the brandy. And and the, I I don't know if you can carry brandy around. If you carry brandy around, you do. But that's you have one hand, not free. I'll shove it down my pants. I don't give a shit. <laughs> All right, move your moving. Why would what? <laughs> okay. Apparently, Josh has brandy down his pants. Wait, does, do you guys have backpack? I mean, like. It's- no, you don't have a bag. No. No, you don't carry around a backpack on you. We're going to have bags and stuff. Yeah. Unless otherwise stated, I assume everything is as normal 1880s attire. Which means you're just wearing like a trench coat or whatever. Oh. Uh, it's pocket dusters. Yeah. All right, Sweet. Josh, you're going to have to call the guard oh, up there. And I'll All just right, kind I'll, of hide I'll call in the off. shadows and literally just shoot him once he comes in the, in the room. Why do you have to hide in the shadows? We're saying he passed out from too much to drink. In fact, well, because yeah. when he comes in, I'm just going to shoot him and kill him. All right. <laughs> There's that. <laughs> oh. I mean, I'm not going to stand in the middle of the doorway with my gun out. I go out of his mm-hmm. office now. What's out, what's outside his office? Uh, two other offices on the other side. If they have VP on them and then some names. Okay. So I'm opening up the doors and peeking my head in real quick. There's offices. What did you expect? I'm making sure nobody else is here. There's oh, no yeah, no one else is closed. here. Hey, you never know. They could be boning somebody in their office. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta make sure of this shit. You'd be a terrible robber, Alan. <laughs> Alright. Okay, so I go down the second floor. I don't see anybody, right? Uh, Yeah, no, it's all cleared out. Okay, I go down to the first floor... And I call from the stairs. Hey, can I get some help? The uh, president had a little bit too much brandy and, and a little bit too much celebratory brandy. And I think so you guys to help passed him out. Down. Okay, help him down. The Ayatollah. Ayatollah. That came up with the Ayatollah. You sound like he's like a Muslim guy. I'm about to say the Ayatollah of Iran. Yeah, I don't know. That's what that called the armadillo people. What are they, am I sp- supposed to pronounce it like that? Latin for, Latin for the uh, armadillo. Oh, at Ayatollah? I don't know how to pronounce it. Anyways, I, I didn't have a name for him. We'll call him Jim. Uh, uh, that name is so, so weird, but 
Why? I don't know. Well, what's a normal a- Ayatollah name, huh? Huh? Okay. He'll, yeah, he comes up to help you. Okay, as soon as he walks in the door, I'm shooting him. Okay, I'm walking behind him, by the way. Okay. Uh, he walks in the door, Alan shoots him. I'm ready, but... This in the head? Or, like, yep. is this a wounding shot? Okay. <laughs> no, in the head. Go on, try uh, to kill. Roll your fighting. Fifty-two. Uh, I'll roll his fighting. He got an eight. Okay. Yeah, fighting he, the one. Oh yeah, yeah. He he has a bullet in the head. He's dead. He he wasn't able to see you in time or anything. Good thing I was in the shadows, Josh. But hey, good do thing make I noise. You realize? Huh? Yeah. 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 So, I don't know why you, you shot a gun, but yeah. I don't I know mean, what these people are. It's not a busy kind of district, magic. but, I mean, it is a, you know, it's a city. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, right. what, what are you hearing inside a building? Like, like, guns are loud. Mm. Okay, what are you guys doing now? Did you have a plan after that? I'm not sure we you have did. To let, okay. Exactly. Oh, yeah, let us let everybody in. So I okay. grab the... I'm sure the guard has keys. Uh-huh. I grab the keys, go down on the first floor, open up the door, and wave them in. Okay. And they're... What are you guys doing? Uh, I'll need to help him carry this shit. You're so small. what time is it? It's like 7 o'clock at this point. Okay. So those bodies are hiding inside of mining equipment. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. So uh, I think Zach and I can start carrying things in there. Okay. Yeah. So they last yeah. in. We start carrying the bodies in. Yeah. Which okay. to uh, outside carry people the looks like. In? A... Just actually carry the carriage in here. Carry the carriage? No, you're an orc, but you're not that strong. I'll say like you can carry two at a time. Chloe can get like the gnome. <laughs> I'll get the gnome. <laughs> well, I'm <laughs> helping them. Yeah, Alan can carry one. You, I mean, it's fine. You guys just carry in mm-hmm. bodies. All that. Yeah, we're carrying all our stuff. Okay. Yeah. And you're just dropping them on the first floor, or what are you doing? Yeah, oh, first no. floor. Oh, no. no. Where's, like, the vault and everything? Yeah, exactly. The vault? Yeah. Why do we, we need to go to the vault? Yeah, Hold the on here. Wait, vault's where behind. do we want the body? First floor, who cares? Yeah. We're That's just trying. Yeah, no, no, no. It, it would look like that we're trying to break into the vault that have too much of, uh, like... Oh, the vault's on the explosive. first floor. Yeah, yeah, the vault's on the first yeah, floor. It's behind the tellers. Yeah, yeah, we'll have the bodies in front of the vault. Okay, yeah. Hide the towers. Okay. Okay, so I'm locking the door after everything's in. Okay. Okay. Oh, uh, uh, Step can, one. Can we also, I think before we're trying to explode them, mm-hmm. uh, did we find a document that they wanted? Oh, okay. You no, know we've mentioned that yet. We, no, we find tie up and blindfold the manager. We, and we need the manager the to floor. talk where they're at. we got to wait yeah. for him to wake up. Okay, okay, so we blindfold and tie up the man, the president. Okay. Take him down to the first floor. Yodel. Yeah, he's still asleep. Right. Mm-hmm. A yodel, by the way. That's how you say it. What Duke? is it? A yodel. A yodel. A yodel. Nobody gives a shit. <laughs> it's very uh, important. Uh, it's incredibly uh, important. A yodel. A yodel. A step uh, one. Oh, all, right, all right, guys. We got What's it. What's going on? Tie up and blindfold the manager and bring him down to the first floor. Okay. Step two. Well, well, that's like one person. <laughs> Step two. Two or three people go upstairs and start looking for documents that we need to destroy. Absolutely. Are we just going to ask the dude? I mean, we can, but we, I mean, we have nothing I mean, else we to have do. Time. <laughs> what else are we going to do? All the money from the teller stations. Uh, uh, no, I wouldn't much with the oh, money. Hold on. So if I'm we not setting off any ask alarm. Yeah. If we this ask that dude, century. Who is that and we let alarm? that dude go, well, that dude, well, that dude will recognize us, right? That's and the he whole would point. also, yeah. he would also know that we specifically asked for those documents. So if he survived, he can present in court that someone actually trying to destroy the evidence, and conveniently, True. those evidence disappear, so we should have avoided the, the argument. The fact that he committed fraud. What? See, what? Wait, what? Destroy the evidence that I committed fraud? 
The evidence that who committed fraud? What? The president of the bank. Who said he committed fraud? What? I don't know what you're talking about. What are you talking about? They, they were destroying the bank evidence. The bank stole the money. No. No, no, no. no. no that's just what the criminals <laughs> Why did you believe the criminals, the guys that worked for the Dorman Mafia, oh. over the actual <laughs> legitimate <laughs> bank? No, I just told you that. <laughs> it was definitely a scam. They had the deposit and withdrawal strip, like, you know, things to prove that they took the money out. Oh, I thought the bank actually threw them over. <laughs> Why? <laughs> I don't know. Well, they just happened to be involved in a criminal organization and they were running a uh, legit uh, bank. We shouldn't I ask the really bank. Oh, I thought they were ripping people off, but then the bank screwed them over on top of it, knowing that nope. they were screwing people over. Nope, they were just trying to blame it on the bank. <laughs> oh, well, then. Uh, <laughs> I got that completely wrong. <laughs> Uh, I think we shouldn't ask bank manager, but uh, we should just certainly search on the second floor. Wait, are we the baddies? You have <laughs> blood in your hotel room. What are you talking about? We are definitely the baddies. <laughs> no doubt about it. Yeah. <laughs> so we'll get our small helmets now. <laughs> we, we can have two people, one second floor, searching for a document. I can start making a bomb. And then uh, we can have another person position the corpses into the right location, as in like they're trying to, you know, set the bomb. Well, who's getting the money? You're making I, a bomb. I thought we were using that gun thing. Right? Like, yeah, yeah, you have a gun that will oh, yeah, an you're explosion. Right. Okay. Oh, yeah. But, we're okay. going to cause some of the accelerant so they make Yeah, you can burn. make the, like, accelerant really? something that will cause a fire to, like, accelerate yeah, exactly. quite a lot. You can do that. Yeah. yeah. So who's getting yeah. the money? What money? money? You weren't stealing any money. Why <laughs> don't we steal the fucking money? It's just sitting here. It's not sitting there. It's behind a massive vault. Yeah. And we have the keys. You don't have any keys. You need a combination, and the manager's currently passed out. Yeah. Okay. can't get into the vault. We're just here to blow this place up. Yeah, and it would make sense if we go, what's the combination, and then we magically blow ourselves up when we had the combination? <laughs> <laughs> we were very incompetent criminals. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nothing can be stolen except papers and stuff that's before the vault. Okay. Yeah. So, uh... I got a couple hundred dollars off the bank manager. Oh, uh, there you go. And some fancy pens. <laughs> big, big victory, yeah. <laughs> you show those pens off. On the day. I'm right, we're starting the next one day with all those pens. Okay, who's doing what? <laughs> I'm searching for papers. Okay. Top floor. Anyone else doing anything? I'm making an accelerator. Okay. Anybody, Josh, what are you doing? I'm uh, blindfolding and tying up the manager. I thought okay. we already did that. Yeah, we already did those. I thought we were saying what we were doing. Yeah, yeah, okay. That's what okay. you're doing. Zach, what are you and Yip doing? I'm bringing them down to the first floor. That's important. What? Okay, you can come down to the first Somebody floor. Somebody tie up the uh, yodel? No, he Dark. shot in the head. He's dead. He's dead. Oh, you just shot him. He's dead. Go <laughs> tie him up if you want, but... <laughs> yeah. Seems a little pointless. <laughs> I'll, I'll keep watch at the, uh, at the window. Um, I should state that we all also hit the wagon. We didn't just leave it chilling out in front of a bank. Oh, yeah. Good point. Okay. Put the wagon uh, away. Bye. Okay, there you go. You can drive that away. You can make our kid away. No, no. We want the wagon... I mean, we horses don't want a wagon would be fun. out in front of a closed bank. No, we want and brought fast. horses a wave that we can go to the horses and ride away out the back. Well, the wagon's well, I think we're still inside right now. That can take it to the back. Yeah, I can take it to the back. That's fine. Okay, so well, are... we die in the explosion, and they're like, "Oh!" And they look. They took the wagon away. No one saw the wagon other than the yeah, bacon. Well, wagon. Maybe some passerby yeah. saw something. You never know. Yeah, I'd leave the wagon out front. We just ditched okay. the wagon. Ooh, that's actually a good idea. Well, okay. That's the point. Okay. That looks like we didn't escape. Right. Yeah. We don't want to make it look yeah, like we escaped. Yeah, that's a good point. That's a good point. We'll leave the wagon out front. I'll just help Alan search through the papers. Okay. Okay. Then I'll make an accelerator and also um, trying to unbox the corpse. And I'm about to wake up the right man, location. Where, where are you putting the corpses? Uh, around the vault. Like around the vault, around but the vault. hiding behind the uh, objects, so that looks like they're trying to 
um, ex- make an explosion in the vault, but trying to shield away, essentially. Okay. And we gave them some of our clothing beforehand? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. We changed the clothes. Okay. Okay. So uh, I'm, I'm trying to I'm, wake up the man uh, here, too. Look, Alan is re- looking through documents, yeah. right? That's what I'm you're doing. I'm using a point to try to find these. Okay. Roll your dice. Oh, God. 20. Hold on, uh, I'm two. With a point, you feel like and maybe you get some mention of some documents that seem like they're related, but you're not 100% sure. Um, you use I'm the sure key. Okay, you can roll yours. Uh, I'm not pretty well. A point. That's, that's crazy just for looking for documents. Well, that's the whole money. point of this freaking thing. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> 49. 49. Uh, what's your knowing? You're retarded, aren't you? Yeah, he's kind super retarded. Yeah. I don't even know why he's looking. He's you remember that looking, you man. basically, it literally says basically illiterate in your knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, remember, you don't even know how to read. Why would you look through documents? Uh, why is he the one helping me? I'm <laughs> 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 We can Josh or Chloe. No, Chloe's I think is I wanted to Chloe like I was is illiterate too. Oh, that's I right. Have, I need literally Josh. <laughs> okay. So, but we back. can burn down all the documents back, if we I can find to... one. That's pretty suspicious in a legal argument. You sound like you're a million miles away. Who? Hmm. There we go. Okay, so Zach. I need you to get this manager awake while I look for the documents because I can read. <laughs> all right. I'll try and do the old classic. Don't you want to do it while he's still sleeping? sleeping? Don't kill him. He's an old man. Don't you want to do it while he's still out? So he knows we're not looking for documents? Oh, him to be awake kill. to where we can say our names. Like, hey. Do that Miso, after we have find you the found document. That? Or not, hey, Miso, have you got this opened? Or, hey, Percy, how are you doing with the vault? Well, why don't we do that after we find the document? That's a good plan. Yeah. Why don't you just do that? Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'll look for the documents. Okay. Roll your knowledge. <laughs> I got 34. Um, you can spend a point, sir. Yeah, no. Right now, you feel like you're on the right path, like, but you're not entirely sure. There's so many fucking documents. It's a big, big bank. Why can't we just put accelerant on all these, this whole document yeah. area? If it's the second awesome. floor, if we start the fire on the first floor, it will travel up. Yeah, okay. and it's paper. That's what I said. It's okay. be it won't burn. I mean, Who has the highest burn. knowing? Uh, I got five. I think, I, me. I think it's me. Roll your knowing, Josh. Hmm. All right. 59. Okay, you think that through and you think... But would it really be that great of a legal argument that the whole fucking thing burned down? It would be better... Only pieces. Yeah, it's only exactly what they say uh, they have, they don't have, right? You know what I mean? The specific documents go missing rather than the whole thing burns down. Which sounds better in court, and which sounds like somebody just paid somebody to burn a bank down. <laughs> is that a legal argument? I, I'm not saying... Yeah, it's not... It's it's not foolproof. That might help them a little bit, but that's something Wait, the bank could claim. Isn't Josh a lawyer? Wasn't he trying to be one? Yeah, the burn of proof is on the thing. Yeah, yes, he was. <laughs> Therefore, <laughs> if the bank burns down, you must have quit. <laughs> <laughs> Her proof is on the state, so they can introduce the documents that say they did this, and ipso facto, they can <laughs> prove that they are guilty. I mean, yeah, that's probably true. But so if it burned down, well, tough shit. It's like the same if you kill a mob witness. Well, yeah, it looks pretty damn suspicious, but they can't testify. I mean, we got some stuff that's probably related and... So we'll definitely burn that, and then whatever else goes, goes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so you're burning... What are you burning? Just gonna burn we're not going to burn it now. I mean, yeah, we're going to put it? it... We're just going to let it all go No, up. No, we're not going to burn it yet. We're going to put it over near the bodies. No, what? we don't want it near the bodies. Why? It's paper. 
Explain so travel upwards. That's a shit ton of documents. How to bring everything if down? If we put the accelerator on the walls, the fire will travel up the walls and burn the second floor. If the first floor is on flames, the second floor will go up too. Well, why don't we definitely so burn the stuff we know that we have? Yeah, you you have some documents, but you don't feel like it's all of them. Yeah, let's you feel make like sure those mentions. definitely burn. Okay. Well, why why burn them? I take them with us. What, what, what am I going to do with, with them? What? We take them with us and burn them in a fireplace to make sure they get destroyed. No, no, take it with you and then you can blackmail them. I mean, if we put them by the body, they're definitely going to get destroyed. If not, we're screwed yeah. anyway. All right. Not dead body. <laughs> no, no, no. That's, that's not a good idea because what if the body was halfway destroyed? You have bits of pieces of that paper. Halfway destroyed. Well, they are it? forensic scientists back then. <laughs> they're, 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 they're not. They're not. I detected a semen on this one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let's just. All right. Yeah. Okay. Put with the bodies. That's fine. Yeah. So you're putting the papers that you did find with the bodies. Yeah. And you're leaving the other papers unscathed. Every yep. all the other files. Wants to get yep. searching. Is the manager awake yet? Uh, I don't know. You're just splashing water on him. I uh, yeah, yeah, splashing some water on him and like kind of doing the old. No, uh, uh, you don't have to. Face. You don't have to do that. I pull out like a bottle of mint oil underneath his nose or something. Okay. So you have like some. You're like uh, that you're one Harlem Globetrotter on Scooby Doo who puts you out of his afro like yeah. randomly that he needed. Uh, roll oh, your oil. making, Chloe. I'll roll your making for you. I'll to roll see it. if you have. Okay, Nine. she got a 61. She wakes him up. Okay, so we are making no sure we say. She's not blindfolded. Name. Wait, what? We are blindfolded. blindfolded. He yeah. is blindfolded. He is blindfolded. Yes, okay. Yeah, blindfolded. He's tied up and blindfolded. And you're mentioning each other's names. Okay. Yeah. Percy, we need to get this bank vault open. What's the combination? No, wait, not that combination. <laughs> <laughs> what? The combination? I don't know. Wait, we're gonna blow it up. Shut up. Don't ask the manager. I'm so confused. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're, sure we're using each other's names, but we're you not. You gotta be like, hey, things. where do we need to run this bomb to? Where's the control? Right. Make sure is. we say each other's names. Yeah. I'm saying I can't believe that Bank Manager is dumb enough to believe that we had we're gonna deposit money. So I mean he knows it. I can't believe you shot that bank guard in the head, Percy. What the fuck? People heard that good shot. <laughs> you know, well, I can't believe Miso was crazy enough for their stupid spice story. <laughs> they would be flat. Parted all around. You're no help whatsoever. <laughs> You've done very well. <laughs> All right. I, I think you get to the picture. Okay. <laughs> Good point, sir. So what are you guys actually doing to blow up the vault? Uh, wait. Like, did I finish making the accelerator? Yeah. Um, I'll roll your making. Fifteen. Fifteen? That's what you're rolling. Do you uh, want to click the button? Oh, uh, no, no, no. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> it's random. That doesn't mean, like, a, a really it's successful or it's, it's not successful? Uh, I don't know. It's probably going to overdo it or underdo it. It's going to be one of the two. Okay, I made the second batch. Okay. <laughs> 88. All right, sounds good. I'll, I'll, you don't know which batch is good and which one's bad until yeah, you use it. Yeah, just put both. Okay, yeah. so you're definitely going to overdo it. Yes. <laughs> right. Overdo the underdo. Hang around the first floor and second floor. I All right. We're just going outside and shooting the stupid Well, the first, we're going to let the manager loose. Oh, yeah, we got to get rid of okay. the Okay, so we blindfold the manager. Wait, wait, wait. Why are you blindfolding him? Blindfolding him? Okay, I guess we untie him. He has to be able to run out. Okay. We lead him to the door and tell him to run. Okay. Uh, wait, why? Well, his okay. hands are tied behind his back. He's blindfolded. Okay. We can't get that off. Let's gag him. Okay. Okay, we gag him. We just tell him to run. We shove him out the front door. Uh, I, I, I don't we, we tell him. Idea. We tell him. We're, but, but why I mean, it's like seven thirty. There might be people oh, around. It might yeah, be what? Seven thirty. Yeah. What? Are I'm you guys waiting till later? No. Yeah, like maybe. He spent was, time searching for shit, and it's okay, still okay, seven thirty. Okay. We'll say it's yeah. Okay. Yeah. We wait till late. 
Okay. We're we no. waiting around really well. Uh, I, okay. I don't think we should release the bank manager like that. No, we do need to release him. He's we need to release him. He has to tell a story that we were in there. No, yeah. he he can tell. No he has, he uh, recognize us, yeah. right? Uh-huh. And yeah. all we need to do is uh, make him unconscious and toss him outside the building. Yeah, that's he true. He wake up on himself. Well, we we just, don't have to release it. That's then he'll know that we release him. Why don't we just take him outside no and smack him on the head? Yeah. 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 In front of everybody? There's going to be 1 a.m. The back. The back of the right. place. Right next to trash can. <laughs> I mean, and we're we're making sure to tell him, you know, we're being pretty nice. We're letting you out of here before we blow the building up. Before we blow yeah. the vault. Okay. <laughs> before we blow the vault. <laughs> 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 By the way, no, the combination. Yeah, the combination. You never know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you drop him off, knock him out in the back. Yes. Okay. And then how are you blowing the vault? You're pouring the stuff all over the vault with dead bodies? I'm pouring it over the bodies. Mm-hmm. And then I'm going to be shooting the And then the up gun. the wall so the, travel, so the fire would travel upwards into the second floor. Because we want the whole building to go up. Okay, where are you shooting the gun from, Alan? Like, where is everyone when this gun's going off? I'll how be far... like a block away at this point. Okay. <laughs> how I'm far? Not <laughs> except for Alan. Let's wait. Except yeah. for Percy. Okay. Is that that right? Yeah. Alan's going to shoot. I'll be idea. with Alan. I'll be with Alan. Right beside Alan. You gotta be able to cloak us or do something. You gotta be able to get out of there. You know I shit when it comes to growing for cloaking. Like no. that'll be the one I failed <clears throat> horrendously. Which one? Cloaking. What? Yeah. Clicking? Cloaking? Is it like invisible? It must be yeah, a cloak like, gunshot. Oh, oh, okay. Gotcha. Mm-hmm. That's how I, I mean, did that. It was awful. Okay. Okay, so. Okay. I'm I'm using a point for the <laughs> shot. Jesus, you're using you. a lot of points. Well, I mean, what okay. else are we using them for? Just gathering yeah. them. You're right. Okay. <laughs> uh, where, 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 what is your position as you are using it? Mm-hmm. Um, I'm Let's behind the, the door. Tree. The back door. There's a back <laughs> door, right? Yeah. Okay, so we're saying it. We can stand in the doorway, shoot it, and run. Whoa! What? Uh, Blows up a whole building. Yeah. Uh, well, hit the bank the door and picture of the back. Can you see the vault from there? No, I you you know. can probably you see a bit of the. You never took like, a picture. Where, yeah, I didn't. You can see where. Uh, Miso put some accelerant, so you yeah, could probably make that. a shot and shoot that, yeah. and it would yeah, lead to the bodies and the vault and everything. Yes. Right. Okay. So you're in the alley and you're gonna shoot yeah. it. Right. Yeah. Right. Okay. Uh, roll your fighting with uh, a point. Right. Uh, sixty-one. Okay. Yeah, you definitely hit your mark, and since Chloe overdid it, mm-hmm. uh, <laughs> like the whole building is like basically. <laughs> <laughs> like it all goes up. It's like completely all three floors almost immediately crumble, Amazing. and it starts spreading to the other buildings. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great news. Very man. quickly. Yeah. <laughs> well, we're decent out though. Yeah, we're going back to the hotel. We're, we're running. Okay. <laughs> all we, right. We leave the carriage over there, and then we went back to the hotel. Yes. Okay. So you guys make it back to the hotel. Okay. And who was? Uh, Heldon was staying with you guys, you and Zach? Yeah. Okay. So you guys, I don't know, you go your separate ways in your room, and you're there for a while. Uh, Heldon's not there, the gnome, Heldon. And you think he should be back at this point, like you you can wait several hours. He never comes back. Not exactly sure where he went. Oh. Like, you left him here, he had never said anything about leaving. Huh. Somebody kidnapped him. Oh, maybe. maybe he just drank this too much. Time, our main mission, now we have failed. So why don't you go ask the hotel manager, innkeeper, whoever, if they <laughs> saw him leave, did he leave by himself? Is that, is that what you want to do? Do you want to continue playing? Is he in playing? our room or is he in... No, he's uh, in no. their room. Okay. Room. So we can... 
to yeah. come out on Picker Pack. I have the next adventure set up, but, like, if you guys... Yeah, this is a good I don't know how long this would take. Okay. Yeah, no, that's a good ending. It takes forever. <laughs> yeah, just uh, yeah, yeah, it does. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, well, actually, I had a lot more planned. Like, if you actually went to that guy's house, I had some things set up, and I don't know. All sorts of things, but no, you guys always take some unexpected path. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> always happens. All right, that was a good game. Uh, let me award yeah, points while I actually remember. That's the thing, I always forget. Uh, see, what all happened? Um, um, I got the bank manager yeah, to actually. You'll get a point for that. That was a good idea. <laughs> um, anything else? I, gotta, I, I actually suggested they freaking interrupt him instead of us going following him and doing that whole m- rigmarole. Oh, was that your suggestion? Yeah, so uh, I'll give yeah, you a point for that. If that was your Maybe idea. I think the guy was my idea in the first place. Which one? I gave you that point last yeah, time. I, I gave you that point yeah, last that time. Time. No, no, I didn't. I gave oh, you right. right. Because you said it didn't happen. But you actually get, went through with it and it uh, worked. Uh, that's right. uh, Chloe, do you want to argue for any point? Oh. Uh, <laughs> I made explosive yeah, but that, no, that's not an idea. It wasn't your idea. Oh, uh, what's not? Oh. Um, what's my idea? She was the one that made the poison. Yeah, but that's part of her. Yeah, and I put in the plan. drink. Yeah, uh, it wasn't anyone's. It has to be your idea. After noticing it was not uh, the correct. I insist that we search on the paper first. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, was anyone else wanting to actually search the papers? Well, no, that didn't yeah. You actually blew them all up. No, yeah, we, like I, I mentioned the the paper, you guys are arguing some other stuff. Like, no, that was Josh know. trying to yeah. steal everything. And it's not entirely an idea, though. <laughs> you got to have an idea that's something that they did. Or I got that... about 200 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> it's some nice pens. Anything? Uh, not the one they actually adopted. A lot of ideas. You almost, if if it would have worked. I know. <laughs> if you I got the manager. That, but yeah. She I was gonna it. build a bomb, but she forgot we had a gun. That's <laughs> 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 no need. <laughs> All right. Uh, I just thought, like, because my making was high, I should have thought about forging those papers, but. Uh, I don't know if you know how to forge. You said you're like a frontiers person. You said you're illiterate. Yeah, yeah, you're not literate. Right. 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 Uh, okay, fine. <laughs> Forge these papers, I don't know what they say. <laughs> this isn't even a language. <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right. Till next time. All right. Nope. All right. Uh, everyone remember to upload your stuff. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. Bye. Later. Later. Bye.